Welcome to Greater Works. I hope you enjoyed today's video, and if you do, please like, subscribe, and comment. In today's video, I'll be showing the break-in of the GO759 milling machine spindle. The GO759 is the same mill as the GO704, except it has a digital readout. Here are some views of the GO759 mill from the front, sides, and back. You can see some of the parts bent, flash rust, and dirt on it. I really like the machine for what it is, a home shop benchtop mill. This is not a bridge port but it didn't cost 5000 either. Your safety is your own responsibility and should be a priority for you. A few seconds or minutes can save days, weeks, months, or even years of recovery. These machines can hurt just as much as the big boy machines. To perform the spindle break-in process, make sure the mill is off and not running and electrical power is disconnected. Set the speed range selector knob in the L low position. Place the spindle direction selection knob in the forward position. Rotate the variable speed knob all the way to the left, slowest position. Connect the electrical power. Open the emergency stop button cover and press the green button to start the spindle. Slowly rotate variable speed knob to the right until the speed is approximately 600 revolutions per minute on the display and run the mill and forward at this speed for at least 10 minutes. When the 10 minutes has elapsed, Stop the mill, place the spindle direction selection knob in the reverse position. Rotate the variable spindle speed knob all the way to the left, slowest position. Open the emergency stop button cover and press the green button to start the spindle. Slowly rotate the variable speed knob to the right until the speed is approximately 600 revolutions per minute on the display and run the mill in reverse at this speed for 10 minutes. When the 10 minutes has elapsed, stop the mill. Set the speed range selector knob in the H high position. Place the spindle direction selection knob in the forward position. Rotate the variable speed knob all the way to the left, slowest position. Open the emergency stop button cover and press the green button to start the spindle. Slowly rotate the variable speed knobs to the right until the speed is approximately 1000 revolutions on the display and run the mill and forward at the speed for five minutes. When the five minutes has elapsed, stop the mill and place the spindle direction selection knob in the reverse position. Rotate the variable spindle speed knob all the way to the left, slowest position. Open the emergency stop button cover and press the green button to start the spindle. Slowly rotate the variable speed knob to the right until the speed is approximately 1000 revolutions per minute on the display and run the mill in reverse at this speed for five minutes. When the five minutes has elapsed, stop the mill. Place the spindle direction selection knob in the forward position. Rotate the variable speed knob all the way to the left, slowest position. Open the emergency stop button cover and press the green button to start the spindle. Slowly rotate the variable speed knob to the right until the speed is approximately 2000 revolutions per minute on the display and run the mill and forward at this speed for five minutes. When the five minutes has elapsed, stop the mill. Place the spindle direction selection knob in the reverse position. Rotate the variable speed knob all the way to the left slowest position. Open the emergency stop button cover and press the green button to start the spindle. Slowly rotate the variable speed knob to the right until, a, until the speed is approximately 2000 revolutions per minute on the display and run the mill in reverse at this speed for five minutes. When the five minutes has elapsed, stop the mill, disconnect the power from the mill, and the breaking is now completed. If you have any comments, suggestions, or concerns, please add them to the comments or send an email. Thank you for watching Graber Works, and I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did like the video, please give a thumbs up, subscribe for future videos, and comment. Thanks again. Mm -hmm.